Hello and welcome back to Microbricks and I'm your co-host Al Bundy. After a very short break, I am back at it again with another story time episode. In this episode, we're gonna move away from the um, very repetitive theme <laughs> that we've had over the last two episodes <laughs> and move on to something a little bit more sad. Today I'm gonna tell you guys about the story where my favorite set got broken by my sister. I just wanna clear this up, this was not directly her fault, it was more so maybe my fault. Now before I do start, I wanna explain exactly what my favorite set is and why. My favorite set is the LEGO Star Wars 2011 Clone Turbo Tank. This was my favorite set for a lot of reasons. It still holds the record for the costliest set I've ever but it still holds the record for being the only set that I've taken apart completely and rebuilt completely at least once. And I just had so much fun at the time when I got the set. It is still one of my favorite sets I've ever had. So it was really sad when it broke. And also I never rebuilt it after I broke it. So this makes this whole story a lot sadder. To start off, I'm gonna have to give you guys a map of how our room looks like. Our room was almost a perfect square, and at the time, it was shared by me and my sister. Thankfully, we now have our separate rooms and now have more space, but at the time, everything was pretty cramped. So, as you can see on screen right now, this was how our room looked like. We had a bunk bed, and then my part was where I had a lego table and there was a small square where my sister was at the back end of the bunk bed where i don't exactly know what she did there but she always had to go through my table and the bunk bed which was a very dangerous area to say the least which i think you know where this is heading one day i placed my clone turbo tank on the edge of that table and well i placed it there and was building at the back end of my table and my sister requested me to go out so she could go through and i did that and i may have accidentally touched my clone turbo tank in such a way that one end of the clone turbo tank was sticking out a little bit more than was safe and then um my sister went past, and I don't know what happened then. Maybe she went through, she swung around and hit it with her hands or with her elbow. Or maybe she just touched the edge that was sticking out with her arm or something. But it fell down. And I remember vividly how the turbo tank just broke apart. I'd experienced a few falls with a clone turbo tank. And none were as terrible as that one. And as I said before, I never rebuilt it. I don't know why I never rebuilt it. I think it was just because I was too angry or maybe just sad. And I had again once rebuilt it. So it was at this at that stage, it was already rebuilt. And I knew how painful it was to build it up again. And even though I could have, I didn't. To this day, it is one of the few sets that I always wish I could still have built. It was really such a good set and it's one set that I always check to see for its availability. If any time maybe there's an offer, I might get it again. It was such a great set and I really do hope that one day I can have it again. Tell me guys in the comments below, what was your saddest experience with LEGO that you guys have ever had? I'd honestly like to know your opinion and as always, if you enjoyed it, please do hit that like and subscribe if you want to see more content. And I will see you guys next time. Good bye.